prison, uh, namely Tommy Chong, who have a criminal record now. Uh, what didn't make it to the program that you'd like to share? Well, I, I, and I think that is that is a really important point. There are 600,000 Canadians walking around with criminal records as a, as a product of possession of marijuana. And, you know, so when people say, is this an issue, it's an issue for them. <laughs> you know, I, um, I, I want to say, but I do want to actually, we haven't been hearing, we've been desperately looking for them, but we haven't been hearing any um, people who don't want uh, legalization, uh, besides, of course, um, the eloquent Diane Watts there. But, and I, and I'm, I, want to, I want to say I'm disappointed in Ashley for not being more passionate. Ashley, come on. Let's hear some emotion. Well, yeah, uh, you know what? I don't get it. You know, there's one in 300 Americans right now with a gun out there on the planet hunting people. If we've got to follow the American code of ethics, then we're not Canadians. Okay, Ashley. I'm, uh, I'm, 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 I'm just being sarcastic. I just wanted to read a couple of um, uh, a, a couple of uh, 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 emails that we've received. The one from Vancouver, B.C., saying no, no to pot. It's a drug which which leads to more potent drug, which destroys kids' lives and takes advantage of the innocent. Ultimately millions for, for Emery. I think he, this person means Mark Emery and his drug lords. How evil. No, no, no. That's from June Boss in Vancouver, B.C. And from Faroon, uh, no, I don't think uh, we should legalize marijuana. In short, because there could be serious rep repercussions in the long run. I know a university student some years ago that had brain problems as a result of using marijuana. I personally have allergies to cigarette smokes. Leave aside marijuana. Who's going to pay my medical bills? This is a question I'd like to ask the supporters of legalizing marijuana so, so, so of course Gianna, as you mentioned not everybody uh, pro on legalization okay. time for one last call gentlemen I have Joel from Sudbury Ontario you've been very patient Joel welcome to the program is it time to legalize marijuana I don't think that marijuana should be legalized I think it should be decriminalized for a period of time until studies can be done to see what actual health effects there is what mental effects there is what effects on society in general like I smoke it well I did recently smoke it myself um, I just quit because I want to see what it's going to be like not smoking it for a long period of how, time how is it so far oh it's it's great it's not like it's majorly addictive or anything I'm just dreading trying to quit smoking tobacco <laughs> <laughs> that may be a harder battle as we know from statistics um, thank you so much uh, I just want comments. one last sure. thing like how many people you know drink and drive you know, they're going to get in an accident. If a pothead tokes and drives, what's he going to do? Stop at the stoplight and wait for it to turn green? Like, come on up. It's pretty harmless. Pretty harmless, you say. Well, we've yeah. heard... We've heard Let's that look into it, though. We, and exactly. And we've Legalization about is like jumping into a pot of boiling water without actually knowing any facts on the matter. Okay, I'm going to thank you for your uh, comments and for joining us here on Play Goes to Pot. We have uh, looked at many reasons Canadians smoke pot, health, artistic, uh, or pure pleasure. And the debate continues to legalize pot or not. And Gianna, it certainly uh, will go on long after this program. That's right, Johanna. Something needs to happen. Either people need to stop smoking or the laws need to change. As I said at the end of Play Goes to Pot, I, I really think that there's a problem in this country with that disconnect. Something needs to change. Maybe the politicians should get their minds in order. <laughs> We're looking at Ashley McIsaac's shirt. I'm going to thank you all who engaged in this debate with us here tonight. I'm Suhanna Marchand. Good night.